and we made it to Poland. What's up, P Nation? Today is our last day in Romania, and we are leaving to go to Poland. We have never been to Poland. We are super excited. We're going to Warsaw, the capital city, on Wizz Air. But first, we have to return the rental car, which we hope goes smoothly. But we might be owing thousands of dollars. No. Like close down the highway, I think the president's coming through. There's policemen like stationed at every little stop, so we thought we were gonna get stopped right before we got here on time. But we I are made it! 10 minutes early, so we'll see how this check in process goes yeah. and if we have to owe a thousand dollars. Well, we don't know that for sure, but we already paid them a thousand dollars. So if we get our thousand dollars back. That was crazy and everything happened so fast. The car rental was largely successful. No hiccups, no nothing. We got our deposit back. So it only cost us 27 US dollars-ish. For plus eight days. Gas. Yeah. For eight days though, that's crazy, yeah. yeah. Anyways, and then we got in the car, the guy drove us to the airport, which was awesome, like service. And we got to the airport and we were worried, we told you guys we were worried about the police stopping everything. Yeah. And they did, right when we got there. So we got to the airport and the police shut down all the roads and all of a sudden this like, barrage of what 30 yeah. Mercedes in a row just came by there was an ambulance or like two armored cars and I was trying to film it and like a police guy policeman saw yeah him. saw me filming <laughs> it and then stood in front of my car window so I couldn't like film it so we don't know who yeah. just passed through who's at the airport right yeah. now they went in the back entrance it's kind of crazy <laughs> kind of exciting but yeah so we are here now we're gonna see if we can get through with air without having extra charges as well I know we're like oh we're spending a lot of money or like we don't want but we're like we're budget travelers we want to do everything right so that's why we're telling you guys mm -hmm. and we won there too All so we're in. two for two I hope this keeps going Whew, just got through security mm -hmm. and now we have to look for a lounge that doesn't exist so we'll keep you updated on that we're two for two maybe we can be yeah. three for three <laughs> two for three, so I can ask for anything else. Exactly. It's been about two hours since we last talked to you. We've just been sitting, we actually uploaded a YouTube video, and Poland is gonna be awesome, but Romania has been really nice. Yeah. People here are amazing. We really, really enjoyed our time. I think more than we expected to. Mm -hmm. Romania is really an expensive place to be. It's like we've saved so much just by being here, mm -hmm. doing everything we wanted to do. All the museums, all the castles, but everything was, was cheaper than we yeah. thought it would be. Yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's, I'm sad to be leaving, but <laughs> I guess it's good to be moving on to something else. Yes, Poland's gonna be amazing. It's actually cooler. It's like 10 degrees cooler. It's gonna be winter time again. Now we're gonna find our gate. We're gonna learn all the history. And we've been learning, news. yeah, we've been learning a lot more history in the countries that we've been to than we ever expected. Yeah. So, Poland was one of the countries we came to for the history, and it's gonna be no exception. So every time we get money at a new place, we have to obviously break it before we get on a bus, which only costs like one. So we decided to come to McDonald's. We got ice cream. And Polish people are so nice. We had like five different employees help us do this. Oh my gosh, this country's gonna be amazing. This is so good. <laughs> but just like we just said, we gotta ride the bus now, so we gotta get to the bus station. I'm 
did it. We're off the bus. Oh my gosh, this is like a communist monument behind me. I'm so here to learn the history. We have so many different time periods for this place. When we were getting off the bus, I was like falling around trying to like film this thing because I didn't know this was a bus stop. But it was like, we have to go. I like dropped <laughs> my bag and then my like pillow fell off. Anyways, we're here now. We're about to walk through the communist block housing to our Airbnb. Okay, we are so lost. All these blocks, communist blocks, get it, are in block number, so it's like six is next to 18, and 18 is next to 12, and we're looking for 12, but we're on the wrong side of 12, because there's like a 12 A, B, and C, but the buildings all look the same, because they were designed in the same style, so, whew, it's just crazy. Leah's like going way that way. I'm trying to find it on this side, I'm just gonna like text and communicate who can find it first. We are in our Airbnb in Warsaw, and now we're about to go get Thai food if Leah can stand up. She's back there, she's tired, we walked really far. Anyways, we have not eaten <laughs> Asian food since we left Asia over a month ago. That's crazy considering how much we loved it when we were there. So this is gonna be hopefully good. Hopefully we'll live up to the hype. We will see. First, we gotta get out of here. What is this like padding? Okay, we got like one lock. Okay, that one's unlocked. What is this? Oh, that one's unlocked. I don't even know how to. Okay, I think that one's unlocked. So that's our building. It's getting worked on, as you can see. And you're probably asking, like, why Thai food? Well, it's a holiday here. What's the holiday called? Corpus Christian food. And it's like a Christian holiday, which just like in America, when you it's Christmas, close things down. all the Asian restaurants are still <laughs> open. So we are so thankful for that. I was like, where are we gonna eat? All the supermarkets are closed yeah. down. Nothing is open. We can't buy all water or any drinks. Yeah, everything is closed. So luckily the buses run one, so we were able to get here. And two, we have Thai food. Okay, so I thought this day would never come. We left Asia and I was like, I'm probably not gonna eat Asian food for a long time. Not because I was burned out, I was just ready for the Eastern European flavors and might be burned out on those. So this is a blessing. This all looks so amazing. We have red curry, we have tom ka, we have yellow curry with chicken and it's gonna be amazing. I already tried some rice and it's like, what is this flavor? Because it's been so long. This red curry is bomb, this yellow curry is even better and we got Polish coleslaw. So it's like interesting to see the fusion of all the different things. On the menu there was like Chinese food, there was Thai food, and there was also Vietnamese food. What? Tom Ka was so good we got two. Put in the work. I'm full, but I am so satisfied. It's like he you knew exactly what I wanted. The lemongrass was like cut in little things, little itty bitty pieces. The bamboo shoots were really small as well and super tender. It's the exact opposite of what Thai food actually is, but it's what we want to eat. So it was amazing. I feel so nourished and we need to go on a walk in the park now. So the mosquitoes are just too much. We're gonna continue this vlog, but it is coming to a close. The day is coming to an end. Thank you so much for watching this crazy vlog. Overall, Wiz Airline was awesome. Yeah. We love Poland. Thai food is amazing, and <laughs> today was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> and we it smells like fish sauce of war paint. I have war paint on me because the mosquitoes in Poland are no joke. I got bit four times already. We've been out here for like five minutes. There's another one. Okay, so we made it to our Airbnb and our 